My name's Cara Gates. I am the Stone and Joinery Director at Concept Bespoke for a little over a year now. Um, before that, I've spent 12 years in the natural stone industry, uh, purchasing stone, designing, um, fabricating, installing, uh, managing those installs on site. So I would say I've seen pretty much everything. <laughs> And the benefits of choosing natural stone uh, as a resource, um, it's so varied, it comes from all over the world. Um, so there's interest there as well as versatility. It adds so much more to your project than um, say a ceramic wood or something that you could get off the shelf. It's bespoke and people are looking for bespoke. Um, if you can imagine it m with stone, you can pretty much make it. Um, it can be applied to a lot of different locations within your build. So um, whether it's a bathroom or a, an entrance hallway, a staircase, um, but you know, also can be applied to bespoke items. So for furniture and um, even lighting, you know, pretty much everywhere. Natural stone, high maintenance, it, it doesn't respond well to acids. Um, but the thing is with natural stone it's highly repairable so if you do spill something or you chip it there are people who are artists in, in repairing um, chips with resin um, or polishing up a natural stone you can't do that with a porcelain or ceramic you'll always see a repair if it cracks there's not very much you can do about it apart from replacing it but with stone it's so much more workable so if um, obviously with a, with a new build sometimes you get settlement cracking sometimes another trade will come along and, and, and damage it sometimes you'll drop something um, so for the end user I find that it would be much more comforting to have that workability with a with a natural stone if you do damage it life happens um, and you can't have with a porcelain my favourite projects are the ones where an architect has a vision um, that on paper doesn't necessarily work, but you can get on board with it. And then it's down to us to design, to take it from that vision and design how it's actually going to work, how we install it, how we manufacture it, how we give the end user a product that works. Um, and that could be, you know, a bespoke piece of furniture, like a, a clad vanity that's supposed to look like a carved piece of, of stone, or it could be a backlit onyx wall uh, with no joints, or it, you know, it could be, it could be a three and a half meter long um, kitchen island unit where or worktop where slabs generally only come in in three meters max, and that's on a good day. Um, there are lots of elements to a project that, that have technical issues and I get a lot of satisfaction from, um, from finding the, the way to achieve it so that we can hand it over to the client and go, look what we did. <laughs>